Just say it. Fuck. I don't think you can. Uh. I, I mean, you, you don't have to mean it. It's true, so it doesn't really matter if you mean it, but it sure would be nice if you did. Just, just say the words. Will it get you to shut up? <gasps> Couldn't hurt to try. You were right. About? We shouldn't have come to this planet. <gasps> Thank you. Now, getting out of this. I think just maybe an apology is in order. Oh, okay. Well? Go ahead. You thought I was going to apologize. You truly are amazing. Why, thank you. How, exactly how, did you fail to mention that this planet has a warrant out for your arrest? Well... For kidnapping, extortion, and murder, I twice. Think... And parking tickets. You keep bringing it up. And I'm trying for a more solution-based approach to our situation. I do, because I can't help but think back to the time when we were on the ship. Let's land here, I said. Oh, I don't think we should, you said. Why ever not? The prospect of commerce and employment is so good. Oh, I just have a feeling we shouldn't go there. Was your feeling, perhaps, just maybe, arising from your apparently massive criminal record? Now that you say it, I think that might have been it. Whereas you utterly failed to mention that particularly pertinent issue. I'm more big picture. Tied up on a crazy planet. Gonna escape if we can figure out how. Doing a strategy, keeping it cool, escaping, escaping, escaping right now! Ow! You're an idiot. Um, I'm doing an escaping montage because someone has got to get us out of this. If we can get turned around somehow, at least we can see the rope. One, two, three, go! <gasps> The Intrepid Adventures of Scepter and Trident will be right back. Now for more of the Intrepid Adventures of Scepter and Trident. I hate you so much. Or do you hate yourself for constantly putting yourself in a situation where you're dependent on my actions when you know I'm irresponsible? No. Wait. What? Boot knife! We're saved! Great, yes. Boot knife. All we need to do is get my boots. Which are, presumably, in an evidence locker or a trash bin or on the feet of some scavenger with an apparently poor sense of smell. Yes. All of which are in the dome and thus totally inaccessible. Yes. Let's call the boot knife plan B. All I have for plan A is my shin shiv. Your... Shin shiv. Don't tell me you don't have a shin shiv. Whatever, as long as it cuts. Oh yeah, it cuts right into my friggin' leg. Ah! I get it. I get it. You know, it wouldn't kill you to lighten up a little bit. Actually, it might, because we'd probably die from radiation poisoning or dehydration or whatever. So, where's this shin shin? You're closest.
I'm going to rock it in your hand. What? I'm going to drop this into your hands. Oh. Why didn't you catch it? Why, oh why, didn't you catch it? You didn't one, two, three, or ready, set, go, or anything. And I think maybe it's time for you to start taking some responsibility here. I mean, it's hard for me to come up with ideas and songs and have extra knives and be the only one trying to cooperate. You are incredible. Thank you. But now I'm going to need your help to get out of this. What do you expect me to... Uh. What I'm going to do is take the knife and cut all the way around your wrist. No. So the skin just slides nope. uh -uh. right off like uh -uh. a glove. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Uh -uh. No. You your hand free. Stop. What you... You want to do the other hand instead? If you can reach the knife, why not cut the rope? That, that is the kind of forward thinking I've been looking for from you. Welcome back to the team, partner. Just cut it. Boom. Done. Good. And now, partner, you can just take the knife ah, and cut me free. Partner? Come on, partner. Cut my partner free. Yeah, cut my partner free. Partner? Come on. Yeah. Partners!